moldable foam soap in grape. I feel like kids are want to eat it. Bubble bath, in the shower. Oh, kids are gonna love taking a shower now. It's moldable, what is that about? Is this one gonna let me make a statue in the shower? That's why I got two, because I'm trying to make a statue. <laughs> it has a really nice grape smell. Also, it is made by crayon. <laughs> that is not moldable. That's just foam. That's not moldable. No wonder they're at Dollar Tree. Oh, shake it, Vivian. You have to shake it real good. Maybe you gotta put a lot. <laughs> it's fun. It smells divine. I'm sure it'll give your kids a nice little lather, but the fun art part of it, yeah, it's not there. It turns the water purple, that's fun. So I bought two for nothing. So I'm gonna give the non-moldable one, Vivian Heads, USB plug cover. Cover these little things. What I thought it was, was to protect it. This part of the cord, has that happened to you? Bust all up and you're still trying to, try, like I have one. I know any day it's gonna be sparks coming out of the thing. Does that scare you? I don't know if that would happen, but I have a cord that is all jacked up. I thought that's what this was for. They do have different animals. Oh, what is this? Quality is a miss. If you have one and you love it and you can't live without it, let me know. Oh, maybe for the kids. I need to call IT support because I can't get it going. Pull it. You gotta get it right. This is tongue. It probably is to protect the cord. Cause now the cord can't get all bendy cause it's holding it. Oh, she's backtracking now. Can we not use it like this? No, you still need this thing. I don't know if it's dumb or cute. Let's see, dumb. But if it serves a purpose, I guess. If you jack up a lot of cords, then you might need this. I'm gonna say pass for us. I don't think this is worth a dollar twenty-five. This is definitely <laughs> this definitely needs to be on the five hundred rollback price items. That needs to go back to a dollar. Make note, Dollar Tree. Make a list of all the things we want to roll back. Don't just do some snacks. We need all kinds of stuff in the store to go back to the dollar. So I'm gonna give the cord protector cover to Vivian Heads Arm and Hammer foaming disposal cleaner. Four uses out of this little baggie. Isn't this nice? Have you ever been in the kitchen and you're like, what is that funk? You have to clean the disposal. Did you know that? I usually just put like baking soda and a little bit of vinegar and then I turn on the disposal and that's how I clean it. But now it's gonna smell fresh like lemon. For a dollar and a quarter, you're getting four uses out of this. I think that's an excellent deal. It says if you have a heavy duty job, then you wanna do it twice. Depending on how dirty your dirty is, then <gasps> it smells so good. I love lemon smells in the kitchen. Like there's nothing clean until you have some lemon smell. It doesn't tell me what a dose is but we're just gonna put a little bit here. I'm gonna put a little water in to see how it bubbles up. That's a little disappointing. Is that it? I don't think there's four doses in here because I thought that would have been a dose. I thought it was gonna foam out of here, but it's doing nothing. Maybe it activates with the garbage disposal. Arm & Hammer is pretty good about stuff like this. So, but just first impressions, I'm gonna give this guy three. Vivian heads. Notebooks, notepads, index card in a spiral thingy. A couple videos back, some people were like, who writes things down? Everything's digital. If you have an emergency, what are you gonna do? Your computer's not working. You don't have access to it. You're traveling. Okay, fine, certain things we don't need to have, but there are certain things that I still believe we have to put on paper. Grandma's address, Uncle Rico. <laughs> <laughs> if you know who Uncle Rico is, then you're my best friend. That's my favorite movie ever, <laughs> if you know who Uncle Rico is. $1.25, look how cute this one is. Spiral, this one is to organize. And then this one, shopping list, your to-do. This was my favorite one because it has little tabs on top. This can be a good goal one. I believe in writing goals down too. That's how I'm successful. I write it down. I'm old school in those ways. I think there's magic in writing things down. Each tab will be a different area of my life. Do it with me. We only have six months, five-ish months left of the year. Pick up one of these. They came in a variety of colors and then three areas to focus on for the rest of the year. Health, wealth, <laughs> a wealth. Two tabs for wealth because that's what we want. And then under each tab, you write your goals and then you check them off. Whatever you're grateful for for that day. Like it's magic. Do it with me. Do it with me. This one is your address book. Have you ever been somewhere and you're like, oh my God, if I had to call my mother right now, I don't know her phone number. Has that happened to you? Oh my God, that's happened. Did your grandma have her things written? She's so cute. Just put all the grandkids' names for her. How cute, that's so nice. All her friends' names. That way when she's sitting at home bored calling everybody, because she's bored as hell, she already has all the phone numbers. This one, passwords. You forgot your password, your computer crashed. Now what? You know now they give you all kinds of codes and all kinds of different things. You gotta have 14 email addresses attached to each account and four phone numbers and all the things that you gotta add. I'm a stationary girl and I buy things like this. I 
least I have partially written down phone numbers. The quality of these two is tight. These excellent. You would have thought I picked it up at Target. If you're using like a marker or something, they might bleed through. So just be careful with those. I'm going to give this guy five Vivian heads and I'll give these guys just quality wise three Vivian heads. Lotion applicator. A dollar and a quarter. I didn't know I needed it till I saw it. I've never thought of this in my life. But when I saw it, I went... Not so much for lotion when I'm tanning because you don't want to get the tan all over your hands because then you start looking all crazy and orange. With an applicator like this, it's good for your back. 99% of the time, my back is not tanned. As long as the front is looking good, I don't care. Now I have no excuse because now you absolutely love for your legs. You guys know I don't wear pants when I'm filming. <laughs> Made for creams, lotions, and gels. Great for hard to reach places. I wonder if you can use it in the shower. It has a really cool texture to it. Am I going to be able to rub it good? So I think it's been around since like the 70s, 80s maybe. It's about to make its comeback after being on my video because it is genius. Put some on there. Actually, some people have problems getting down to their feet and their legs. It rubbed that right in. I was afraid it was going to leave like a whole bunch of lotion on top. With just regular lotion, it works like a dream. I don't think they said to rinse it off or nothing. I think you just keep using it. The quality of the actual handle is not that great. The quality of the foamy thing is not that great. But it does the job, okay? You paid $1.25. Everybody calm down. So for all of those reasons, I'm going to give this guy three Vivian heads. Travel toothbrushes. And not just any travel toothbrush because they have little things that you can attach to your toothbrush. This is all in one. Like you don't need anything separate. They give you the toothbrush and then it folds in half. Is that not good? Instead of just buying the top of it, you get two brushes soft, which I think is important, right? So you don't hurt your gums. You're getting two of them for the great, great price of $1.25. That's an excellent deal. Sometimes I throw these away as soon as I get back from vacation. Like I don't reuse these because sometimes they get gross. Sometimes I dropped them. I'm not sure if somebody touched it while I was out the pool. It also includes a tongue cleaner. You don't got to get all fancy. You don't need the fancy toothbrush when you go out of town. You know what I'm saying? You don't need your Sonicare or whatever. You just need a toothbrush, period. It's just to get through the vacation. You don't got to take an electric. Have you ever been with that annoying person on vacation? <laughs> they want to take their electric toothbrush. Listen, sir, you take a Dollar Tree toothbrush with you and you're done. We're only gone for three days. Calm down. Your teeth ain't gonna fall out if you don't have your electric toothbrush. Look at this, this is gonna work. You don't have to take nothing fancy because what if you lose it? What if it gets gross? Hell, I don't know, this is easy, easy peasy. Look, when you're done, pack it up. Nobody touches it, it doesn't get dirty. Particles in the air are not gonna get in it. The bottom piece, the handle part of it is really nice. It has a nice like rubber. Thing to it. The brush head itself is a little bit big. I like like half the size of this thing, but it's fine. Like I said, it's just for the vacation. It has the tongue cleaner on the back of it and it came in a couple different colors. I got green and blue, my two favorite colors. I thought it was a great deal because guess what? You don't have to buy a separate toothbrush and the separate little travel case for it. No, it's all in one. Brand new product. Good luck finding them. I haven't seen them in a lot of Dollar Trees and you guys know I go to a lot of Dollar Trees. I've only seen them in like two so if you see them, even if you're not going on vacation yet, I would say pick them up because who knows if you'll ever see them again. <laughs> I cannot hype them up on quality wise because it's not that great. It's just to get us through vacation. We work with what we got in this scenario. But the idea, the design of it is excellent. And the price, are you kidding me? No brainer. So I'm going to give the two pack of travel toothbrushes, three Vivian heads, Nano Grab, Alien Tape, whatever you want to call it. Well, here's the name brand. A lot of brands make it now. I think the original as seen on television one was called Alien Tape. I had to pick this one up. I couldn't find the Alien Tape. This one cost me $5 and like Dollar Tree. They're on a roll. Keep it going, Dollar Tree. You can now pick up Alien Tape at Dollar Tree. This one cost me six. This one cost me a dollar and a quarter. The Dollar Tree one is giving me 3.3 feet of double-sided tape. The brand name one is giving me five feet of product. So a little bit more product, but all the savings, especially if you don't know how this product works or if it's going to kind of work for you, this one might have a better grip. I don't know, but I'm just saying, if you want to start here and then if you love it, then you jump over here. That's what I always recommend. Start at Dollar Tree. No harm. Save yourself a lot of money. 
If you absolutely love the product and you're like, this is awesome at $1.25 and $1.25 quality, you're gonna love the brand name one. They both say that they are reusable. I don't remember that from the alien tape that I tried, but these both say wash and reuse, multifunction, waterproof, indoor, outdoor, perfect for most surfaces, leather, wood, concrete, marble, and more. Brand name one says it will hold up to 20 pounds per five foot roll. So I don't think a little piece is gonna hold 20 pounds. So just keep that in mind. You'd have to use the whole roll. Three inches will hold one pound. When I saw this at Dollar Tree, I about fell over. They are like balls to the wall. Vivian has pumped us up. She is our hype girl. <laughs> She's telling us to keep it going. Look at those two. Which one's which? The only difference is this one has more product. I hate the alien tape because it's so sticky. Like once you open it, if you touch anything with it, it's stuck. Keep that in mind if you've never used a product like this. Dollar Tree. I'm gonna put it on top of here because they will stick to the table. That's what happened to me when I tried the original one. I almost had to throw away the damn table <laughs> because even the side of it here is super sticky. The Dollar Tree one seems a little thinner. Brand name one is a lot thicker for sure. <laughs> this is so sticky. I never got it. I didn't get it at the time. I don't get it now. We'll give it a try since Dollar Tree has decided that it is worth the duping. I do like that the Dollar Tree one is so clear. Maybe because it's thinner. It is crystal clear. I've taken out my beautiful wall that we've had for years and years. I don't know if you guys can see it, but on this side here is the thicker brand name one. And then right next to it here is kind of green. That is the Dollar Tree one. Remember, it's saying it can hold about one pound. So I got all of these batteries. We're gonna stick the pack to this to see if it's gonna hold my batteries. This should be about one pound. Should be an easy test, right? Brand name one is holding up all my batteries. I did not expect it to fail on me. The Dollar Tree, let me make sure it's closed. Batteries are back in. One more time, Dollar Tree. The brand name one worked beautifully. It's making me very nervous. It's holding it and let's take it off. Oh uh, no, I don't trust that. I don't know if it's because it's so thin or what, but I don't trust the one from Dollar Tree. So I'm going to say stick with the brand name one. This one, maybe for light things or, you know, silly things around the house, but nothing expensive, nothing super heavy. This test made all the difference in the world. For this one, I'm going to say stick with the brand name one. Dollar Tree, great idea. Nice shot. So I'm going to give the brand name one five Vivian heads and I'm going to give the Dollar Tree one two Vivian heads. DIY letterboard sign. When these first came out a couple of years ago, expensive. You couldn't get one of these little letter boards for less than 20 bucks. Comes with the alphabet or the letters in the back. It includes 129 letters. And if you guys don't want to hang it with this like rope, guess what else they have at Dollar Tree now? A command strip with Velcro. And you know what they're recommending it for? Pictures. No longer nails on the wall for pictures. Now put two of these with the little Velcro and then you just Velcro your pictures onto the wall and you can take them off whenever you need to. If you're renting in a apartment, whatever, a house, it doesn't matter. If you don't want to ruin your walls, four pairs for $1.25. Came in both black and white. If you can't get a command strip or you don't want to spend command strip money because they are kind of pricey, but totally worth it. If they would sponsor me, I would totally take that sponsorship because their product is so good. But if you can't and you don't wanna, try these from Dollar Tree. You might love them. Okay, see, these are paper. <laughs> it's the front and the back. Slide them right in. They're not fancy, don't touch it. You know, that kind of attitude is what we're gonna have with these because very delicate. Maybe you can laminate these, make them last longer. Dollar Tree, <laughs> here we go. Dollar Tree must roll their eyes every time I say, hey, Dollar Tree. I know they're watching. It would be cute if you gave me some emojis or some cute little hearts or something. Let's see what these are all about. So I don't want to punch a hole in the wall if I don't have to. They even have the little arrows. You know how the little command strips have the little arrows to tell you like tug down. I'm just going to do it in the center. One should be good. This thing is not that heavy. And you take the other one. Remember, you're getting four sets. This is the one that you put against the wall. When you're ready to remove it, you unvelcro it. You pull this piece down. No holes in the wall. Now I have heard these dupe velcro command strip are not the best. So try them before you hang something heavy or something important. That way you're not having to worry about it. I think it might work. So just based on my first impression, I'm going to give command strip dupes three Vivian heads. I'm going to give the little DIY letter board three Vivian heads. Toilet cleaning gel stamps. Here's the brand name one. Have you seen those commercials where 
where they put the stamp in the toilet of the little gel and it kind of just stays there and with every flush it like freshens the toilet. Don't get me started on does it work. But Dollar Tree has a dupe. I've had this probably six months because I used it once. I don't like anything about the brand name one and I also don't like the price. And I actually did a little math for you because some of you guys asked me to do a lot of math. And so today I came prepared. You're welcome. Brand name one is going to cost us $4.67. With the brand name one, you're going to get six stamps out of it. It, it smells horrendous. Dollar Tree, $1.25. So already by purchasing the one from Dollar Tree, we're saving $3.42. I'm going to hate it and hate the smell. <laughs> Only waste $1.25. The Dollar Tree one brings 14 stamps. So I did more math for you. Dollar Tree one, you're paying nine cents per stamp. This one, you're out of your mind. 78 cents per stamp. Which one do you want? It's just going in the toilet to flush. After the first few flushes, it's just a blob sitting on the side of the toilet. A toilet paper can get caught up. It's just a nightmare for a girl like me who's a germophobe and just seeing that blob sitting on the side of the toilet, I don't like it. So just based on savings all day, Dollar Tree. This one has a cover on it and it comes in here. Each little notch on the side that you move up is a stamp. And even in here, it's sealed. I can smell it. It's just like a little gel, but to me, it doesn't dissolve fast enough. Like it just sits on the side of that toilet. You put it on the side of the toilet and then you push in the little notch so that it goes down one. It does look like a little flower. Let's see what the Dollar Tree, are you kidding? Immediately, yes. Dollar Tree's brand name. I even like that this one is like a blue color. Squeeze down. The one from Dollar Tree is smaller but cuter. It looks like an actual flower, but I feel like maybe the size and the way that it's shaped, maybe it'll flush better. And the smell, kind of like a baby powdery kind of smell, which I usually hate. This one is so strong and just that I'll take this any day of the week. Look how thick that is. No wonder it just sits there. Is that ever gonna come off the toilet? It feels a little bit softer. This feels like glue. This feels like hair gel. This is how you would do it on your toilet. Pull it off. Oh, interesting for like two days. I think it's on. It's kind of ugly. I think in the toilet, it'll work a little bit better just because of the shape of my little glass jar. Already the one from Dollar Tree is melting. Some people are not gonna like that, but I'm definitely leaning towards the one from Dollar Tree. Color, smell, price. So for all of those reasons, I'm gonna give the brand name one, one Vivian head, and I'm gonna give the one from Dollar Tree, three Vivian heads. LED butterflies. I don't know for what. It has a flickering effect. It has like a little sticky backing. Can you hang it on the door or something? Dollar Tree, don't roll your eyes at me. I got great ideas that I like to share. <laughs> if y'all could just make it vibrating. Look at them go. I don't know how we would use them for something crafty, I think. When you're not using them, you can turn them off. Give me ideas on how we're going to use these. Can we put them in the plants, in a reef, at the front door, at the mailbox, at night? You guys are so smart, so I know you're going to have all the ideas in the comments down below. So for all of those reasons, I'm going to give these guys three Vivian heads. Scotch blue painter's tape, Dollar Tree's dupe. If you've never used painter's tape, it's so that when you paint, it leaves a nice crisp line and it doesn't bleed through. The blue painter's tape works like a charm. This one's $1.25. The brand name one is $3.56. So you're saving $2.31 by buying it at Dollar Tree. You do get a little bit more though in the scotch. The brand name one is giving you 60 yards of product. Dollar Tree one is only giving you 17 and a half yards of product. You're paying per yard for the Dollar Tree one, 71 cents. Ouch. Scotch blue painter's tape. You're only paying six cents a yard. That's pretty damn good. <laughs> Very nice. And it is paper tape. Oh, there's a difference. You can hear the difference. So here we go. Here's the brand name one. ASMR at its best right there. Now listen to Dollar Trees. A little rough around the edges. Okay. The brand name one, when we take off that tape, perfect straight line. The one from Dollar Tree says, less edge bleed. It is UV and sunlight resistant. Does that matter, UV and sunlight? Okay, they're dry enough. We'll start with the brand name one. Fingers crossed it doesn't fail us. Interesting. Not a completely, maybe because it's not 100%, it's about 90% dry. It's never failed me before. Let's try the one from Dollar Tree. Nope, that's a fail. Just buy the brand name one. That bled through even more than this one did. So I'm going to say don't even spend the money on this one. Go get the original brand name painter's tape. So I'm going to give the brand name one four Vivian heads and I'm going to give the Dollar Tree one one Vivian head. Pumpkin decoration. It's like lace with wire. Let's see. 
Oh, cute, because it looks like a candle. Ooh, I love that kind of spooky looking. If it just twinkled, Dollar Tree. <laughs> I'm just giving you guys ideas to make it better. You don't gotta do nothing. I'm just making a suggestion. It's very, very bright. It's a little basic. It's kind of a filler decoration, you know, kind of just to put in between some stuff. So for all of those reasons, I'm going to give the Lacy Black Pumpkin three Vivian heads. Cetaphil Gentle Face Wash. Both eight ounces of product. $1.25 at Dollar Tree. Brand name one at Walmart. $8.78. By buying it at Dollar Tree, we're saving $7.53. They're both eight ounces. Per ounce is costing you $1.10. Dollar Tree per ounce is costing you 16 cents. I mean, why not? The brand name one, tested and true, their products are amazing. You cannot go wrong by buying it. I have no bad things to say about this, except it's a little bit pricey. The ingredients are very similar. It promises to be a low lathering formula, which is good because hopefully it's not drying your skin out. That's what's so good about this guy. The Dollar Tree one says you can use without water or you can use with water. That's weird. Without water, gently massage, remove product with a cloth, allow a thin layer of the cleanser to remain. Huh? We'll start with the one from Dollar Tree. Very watery. Why is one clear and one... Oh, this one doesn't say sensitive. I think I might have picked up the wrong one. Ooh, it feels like lotion. So now after rinsing off the product, the brand name side feels a lot softer and more moisturized than the one from Dollar Tree. But for $1.25, I don't know. You might want to try this thing. So just based on first impressions, I'm going to give the brand name one four Vivian heads and I'm going to give the Dollar Tree one three Vivian heads. LED coasters. I I saw this on coaster. <laughs> Only one? I know I'm at Dollar Tree and I shouldn't be picky, but I thought I was getting a couple. Like who has one drink? but it has LED lights. Uh-uh, five below. <laughs> you know, five below has everything LED. Shower heads, toilet rolls, everything. Dollar Tree is like, y'all copy us, we're gonna copy y'all. In the front, it has on and off. Can we take this off? Oh my God, the battery's under there. I don't think you're supposed to touch that. It's gonna be wobbly because of that little thing. Come on, Dollar Tree, let's see. Turn it on. Oh, it's totally worth it. For Halloween party, for all kinds of parties, not just Halloween, all year round. Dollar Tree, what are y'all doing? See, I can never talk crap because they always surprise me like this. Off. I don't like the sticker at the bottom because if we have glass like this, you're gonna see the sticker. Turn it on with the cup. That's a bit intense though. Oh my God, my eyes. Here we go, got it. I don't know, you gotta click through. Look how cute that looks. <laughs> this is great for a little party or a little experiment and you wanna get some cool graphics. No, it just stays on. Okay, you gotta play around with that, but it looks like an alien spaceship. Be very delicate with it because I think I already broke it. See Dollar Tree, you can't just put a sticker over the top because people like me are gonna ruin it. The sticker is also a paper sticker so if you're putting a beverage on top it's getting wet. Dollar Tree y'all did almost good. Maybe when I opened it I loosened the battery. It went from bad to amazing to bad. I do love the idea though. Quality wise it's just okay. The design is what are y'all doing? One last request at least two per box. What am I gonna do with one? So I'm gonna give this guy one Vivian head because it stopped working on me. LED metal skull lamp with an on and off switch. It has that day of the dead look to it. It looked really cool, but what do you mean metal? It is metal. It's like 3D or something. Look at the inside of it. Maybe that gives it some kind of effect. I don't know what I thought it was gonna be. I just don't get it. A bit simple. The 3D effect is okay. Nothing that wowed me. So I'm gonna give the little metal skull to Vivian heads. Flushable moist wipes with vitamin E and aloe. Right, just immediately don't. If it dissolves into nothing in seconds, then I'm gonna say buy a case of these but I've tested enough of these flushable wipes in the past that none of them, even the expensive ones, do not dissolve the way you think they're gonna dissolve. Risking it means you clog it up and a plumber's coming out and charging you that service fee. 36 wipes in here, maybe for like a vacation when you're going out of town. I'm still saying don't flush it, like don't ruin somebody else's toilet, but maybe wipes like when you're out and about so you can be fresh. I would not use them in my house. No way, Jose, I don't care. Flush no more than one wipe at a time. There's the disclaimer. Who needs 
with one wipe. You didn't get it good <laughs> with one wipe. Absolutely not. Stop. It smells very lovely. Feels like the expensive stuff. Drop it in here. These do not dissolve. I don't care what they say. If you're a plumber, I need your backup here. We need to tell people to stop using these damn things. Do you see how fast toilet paper will dissolve? We're going to go on to the next product and we're going to check back on this guy in a few minutes and you're going to see. That is intact. <laughs> it smells nice. Quality seems nice. I'm going to give them that and the price is great for 36 of them. But flushing it, no. Let's do our final check on this guy. It's been about 30 minutes since we put this in the water. Not even a little dissolved. So I'm going to give the flushable toilet wipes. One, Vivian head. It's for freshness on the go, but don't flush this. Light up LED lantern in two colors, black and orange. It has a little LED tea light in there. Fingers crossed that it reflects like the crazy skeletons that are coming after you. Pretty great size for the price. You can either hang it up or put it on the table or maybe outside when the kids come trick-or-treating. Maybe you put it next to the candy. It's just okay. I'm not so impressed with the way it looks. It's a little bit plasticky. I don't think it will last you long. I'm gonna say pass on this one because I need a wow factor. I need a I'm jealous. Where did you get that kind of reaction from people to make it worth <laughs> my dollar and my quarter? I'm comparing it to the other stuff in this video and this one's kind of basic. I'm gonna give the LED lantern to Vivian Heads. Prayer cards. Excuse me, I did not see any others in the store. I don't know how this got snuck in. I think it's like a real brand. Super cute packaging. It includes 12 prayer cards, inspirational prayers and scripture cards for yourself and others. You know what kind of business we're about to start? Call me and I'm gonna do a private reading for you. Like they do on the TikTok. They all say the same thing. They all say, you know, I was in the shower and I got a message downloaded. Look how pretty the packaging is. I was shocked when I saw them. I looked around, I didn't see any others. Take them out. Oh, today's prayer. Do they all say that? Yes. <laughs> this is what they do on TikTok. If you're here, you're here for a reason. <laughs> And then they do this really fast and then they drop. That's the one that they want me to read to you. If this speaks to you, confirm it by subscribing to my channel, sharing the video with your family and your friends and it's prosperity forever. Oh, there are your cards. Three cards got selected. Three of y'all are the lucky chosen. I awaited patiently for the Lord to help me and he turned to me and heard my cry. What that means is that we all hear you. Next card, the Lord is near to the brokenhearted and saves the crushed in spirit. Did you hear that? I hope that spoke to you. The last card I drew for the day, nor height, nor depth, nor any other creature shall be able to separate us from the love of God. God, which is Christ Jesus our Lord. These don't sound like other scriptures. All of these are just scriptures. It's a scripture and a prayer the same. It's cute. Like if you're in doubt, close your eyes like this. Just draw something. The quality is okay. A lot of copy and paste. It's okay. Grandma might like it. She might not. But for somebody that goes to church a lot and loves stuff like this, there you go. Dollar Tree has them now. So I'm going to give the prayer cards to Vivian Heads. Glow in the dark skeleton head. A Look how big this is. This is not some little miniature thing that you're getting for $1.25. It is a full sized <laughs> and it's glow in the dark. It did come in another color, but glow in the dark. Let's just cross our fingers that it really does glow in the dark. Like I have high expectations for this because if it just looks like a little orange glowy thing, <laughs> then you're getting zero Vivian heads. I need you to look like a skull when I turn off the lights. I'm on the fence about this one. You can kind of see it glowing. You kind of can't. It kind of looks like a blob of something. <laughs> it kind of looks like a skull. I have to get back to you on this one. Once it like sits in the living room and gets light and la 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 charges, whatever this glow in the dark material does, maybe it'll get better as time goes by, but just right off the bat, it's just okay. So for all of those reasons, I'm going to give this guy three Vivian heads. LA Colors lip balm. This lip balm changes color, I guess, depending on your pH. I don't know how these things work. I have to take off some of my lipstick so we can test it. Okay, that's as good as it's going to get. It says it is scented with lemon. This one is scented with rose oil. I always love this because I want to see what color or how this technology works. Let's see how much product you get. Hey, that's quite a bit of product. Here's the before. I'm going to just do one side. It smells really nice. I don't know if I keep applying it, if it makes a difference, but it is changing color. Very light, very mild, maybe for a teenager. So I'm going to give the LA Color Lip Changing Balm to Vivian Head. Pure Beauty Face and Neck Lift Roller helps lift jowls 
wrinkles and reduce puffiness helps stimulates blood flow for a brighter complexion. I don't believe any of that, but okay, I'll play along. For $1.25, why not? I think on TikTok, they're calling it being Delulu. <laughs> so when I'm using this, I am being a Delulu. To use on neck, place on either side and do like just roll it on your face. Just be careful. Don't get crazy with it. You guys know I don't believe any of these, especially a product that doesn't have some kind of electricity, current, charge, something going through it, but plasticky things like this. <laughs> They're just for the Lulu days. <laughs> this is gonna lift jowls. Are you kidding me? This is silly. This is for pretend. This is for let's relax and just massage myself. Feels good. It's relaxing. It feels nice on my skin. But is it moving blood? Is it circulating motion? Is it brightening my complexion? <laughs> Absolutely not. And it is so thin. It's gonna snap if your face is not petite. <laughs> I love Dollar Tree, but some things are silly. This is silly. There are so many great things at Dollar Tree that you can spend those five quarters on. Don't spend it on this. I mean, maybe it is. Massage your buckle fat. So I'm gonna give the face and neck lifting roller one Vivian head because it's relaxing. That's it. I don't know about brightening your complexion. LED projector light across the ceiling. This one doesn't have batteries and it looks super basic. Fingers crossed, we've had great luck. Look how cute this is. You can tilt it. This one's very basic, okay, plasticky. I do love the tilting technology because it goes all the way around. Tell me that's not impressive. Turn off the lights, Vivian. Right there, the graphics are really nice, but that's not gonna help most of us. Nobody's gonna want to sit that close to the screen. Wonk, wonk. That was an absolute no. Do not waste your money on this. Like, if it's this close to the wall, it's gonna be beautiful. So, let's all agree to skip this one. So, I'm gonna give the little projector zero. <laughs> Vivian. <laughs> this is new. Handheld bag sealer with magnetic strip. I've always seen these and I thought that's gimmicky. They've never worked for me ever. I got that bag, which is a little thicker. And then I have this cheese it bag, which I think is a little thin. Oh, somebody ate the cheeses. Let's trim some of this off. This is a 100 calorie stack. Remember when that was very trendy? And they would give us six and be like, that's 100 calories. And we would pay extra for them counting out the six. We're silly cats, aren't we? This was the only one in the store too. I don't know if it was a fluke. There's the magnet strip so you can put it on the fridge. I love the color. It's like bubble gum. Batteries are in. Do not use rechargeable batteries. Keep away from children. Keep sealer clean and dry. Put it on the end. Down. Is that working? <gasps> that is the first time in the world history of Vivian tries that this thing has worked. I'm not doing all this. My paper clip would have already sealed it and I'd have been on the couch <laughs> immediately. Maybe this is for like camping trip or you're throwing stuff in the purse and you don't want it to leak out or maybe you're taking a road trip and you need to seal some stuff up. This one's thick. Only where I touched it to begin with, not when I slid it by. Partially, yes, just this one little area. It's okay. But you know, I've seen on television people used to sell the hell out of these for $19.99. <laughs> for me, I'm just like, ah, for a dollar and a quarter, fine. Once in a while, you might use it. It is a bit plasticky. The color is cute though. I love the little magnet. So I'm gonna give this guy, guess how many Vivian heads? I'm gonna give this guy two Vivian heads. Fall scented tea candles. Talk about putting me in the mood. I haven't been in the mood for fall and winter and Halloween y kind of stuff until I pick these up. I think they had like four or five different scents. I picked up the pear nutmeg, smells heavenly. There's six in there for a dollar and a quarter. Urban barrel pumpkin, gingerbread frosted cookie. They're so little that you're gonna be able to rotate them a lot faster than a candle. You know, a candle takes time to burn through. Look, look at this one. Wait, look at this one. <laughs> Put these in here. Oh, at night, it's gonna be such a mood in your house. And wait, one more. These don't have to just be tea candles. Like, I think you put like little votives in these. But I just thought the tea candles were so perfect. Look how cute the pumpkin one is. The back is open. I think they are made for like tea candles like that. How cute is this? The Frankenstein one is open on the top, I guess, to let the flame out. Excellent quality. The paint job on these, so good. If you wanna use one of these candles that are a little bit taller, I think you can as well. I'm gonna turn off the lights so you guys can see how cute these are. You really can't see the pumpkin very well. Pumpkin, super cute, right? I think that one you can see a little bit better. Here is the votive and the spider one. This one definitely looks a lot better than the tea candle. This one definitely needs to be a 
tea candle because it is touching the actual ceramic. So while cute, I think that this one might be a fire hazard when you use a votive like this. This one has a little opening on the top. Our last little jack-o'-lantern. I still feel best with the little tea candles, except this last one. This last one was fine. Like the flame was in there. Now, once they were burning, I no longer smelled this scent. So that's a little disappointing. Just sitting here in the box, they smell divine. So I'm gonna give the little candle holders five Vivian heads, and I'm gonna give the scented tea candles candles to Vivian Heads. Dr. Teal's Sleep Lotion and Dollar Tree's Dedupe promotes a better night's sleep. Eight ounces of product for $5.87. The Dollar Tree one, a dollar and a quarter. And also Sleep Lotion. This one has lavender and chamomile. So does Dr. Teal's. How much are we saving? $4.62. I don't know if I believe in this stuff though. Lavender does nothing for me. Some people swear by it. And here's a pet peeve of mine. Lotions, creams, things that people can try on and smell in store when they're not sealed. Like people will use them. Oh, that smells nice. I bet you the Dollar Tree one is sealed. How come they have a budget with five quarters? Nobody's gonna touch it, nothing. This one per ounce is costing us 73 cents. This one per ounce is costing us three pennies. Let's try the brand name one first. I feel like I'm at the spa when I smell lavender. It's fine, it's very mild. It's actually really nice. When I go to bed, I do not wanna be smelling like flowers and the garden and Whole Foods. I think it helps kids more. If it helps you, let me know. Why am I relaxed? <laughs> Wait a second. All of a sudden, I'm chill. It does not work that fast. Vivian, that is in your head. It's very nice. It's absorbed nicely. No stickiness, no nothing. Actually, for the price, it's not bad. I would say it's a fair price. Dollar Tree. Uh, I'll wear that all day. This one, lots of lavender, lots of chamomile. This one, Fruit Loops. <laughs> I don't know how that's gonna help you sleep. He is not gonna let me sleep if I smell like Fruit Loops. I don't smell chamomile at all. Lavender is the last item on here. You guys tried hard, but y'all missed. Y'all are known for that. I've been calling y'all out, Dollar Tree, for smells, scents, flavors <laughs> for years. <laughs> that does not smell not a lick of lavender, not a lick of chamomile. So while cute and a copy, not a copy. So for all of those reasons, Dr. Teal's, I'm impressed. I'm gonna give this guy five Vivian heads, believe it or not, for the price, I think it's fair. And I'm gonna give this guy two Vivian heads because what are you doing? What is this? <laughs> I'm confused. Green tea infused hummus stone. I think it's pronounced hummus by our favorite brand, Be Pure at Dollar Tree. Can be used wet or dry, removes dead skin from your feet, hands, and elbows. Mm. Soak skin for a couple of minutes in warm water. It is infused with green tea, which I don't know what are the benefits of infusing this thing with green tea. Why does that feel so hard? The one I have in my shower feels like an actual stone. This feels like a sponge. It does have like a green tea kind of smell. I wouldn't use it dry. It's getting everywhere. It feels like styrofoam. Let's wet it to see if it becomes like a sponge. Put it in the water so it doesn't get all sandy on you. Let's do the elbow because it is crusty. No, I can't. Not the elbow. I'll do it on my feet. What is this stuff left behind? It's like sandpaper. I would not use that. No longer smells like tea tree or anything. If you love this and you know how to use it and you want to give us some tips in the comments down below, please leave us some, but I don't get it. I don't think I would use it. So just based on like my first impression, I'm going to give this stone thing to Vivian Heads. Glitter bath bombs, vanilla scented. You're getting two of them. I'm kind of concerned, but I'm kind of like, okay, that that's fabulous. A lot of people say different things. Don't put things like this around your church. I get it. But it is gonna glitter like gold, honey. Maybe just for the one time. Here's my disclaimer though, besides the church disclaimer. These have stained people's bathtubs. So be very careful with bath bombs. Really nice vanilla smell. I'm gonna jump out of that tub. He's gonna lose his mind. Problem is, it's so hard to open. You're gonna scrape all the damn gold off. I want some more of these because I feel like it's just glitter. It's not like dye or color. The glitter is powdery soft.
This was a good find. It is still bubbling up in there. You're gonna have to use both for a regular size bathtub. I mean, look how small this is. So I'm gonna give the glitter bath bombs three Vivian heads. Hello spray. I hadn't seen anything like this before. Dr. Teal's is doing a whole line of these kind of sleep stuff like the lotion and now the spray for your pillow. It's gonna put you to sleep. And as a matter of fact, this went like viral a year ago and people were going crazy because someone said that as soon as their head hit the pillow, they were out with a little bit of this spritzed on. Dollar Tree heard that and they saw that video because they said we could do it too for a dollar. The Dr. Teal ones cost me $5.87 and then for five quarters per ounce, the brand name one is costing us 98 cents. The Dollar Tree one is costing 25 cents per ounce. Use on pillow and bedding for sleep time blissfulness. Mm -hmm. Spa, grassy, lavender, chamomile smells. <laughs> it's a miss. I smell lavender. There is all kinds of other fragrances. It's not bad, but it's not this. This is a first impression, right? Follow me on Instagram, Facebook, wherever you want to follow me. And if I remember, I will update you guys. I might not remember because I just fell asleep. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Nice spritz from both. Okay, I can see why this went viral. The smell is there for lavender. It's mild, it's very like, Dollar Tree, y'all need to pull all these, not because they're bad, pull them because the scent is off. Someone didn't buy the, the brand name. Y'all just try to guess what it would smell like and it's a miss. So I'm gonna give the Dr. Teal's five Vivian heads and I'm gonna give the, yeah, Dollar Tree <laughs> dupe one Vivian heads. If you wanna continue watching videos like this one, I would recommend you watch this one next.